All right, so y'all wanted to figure out how cheap we could get tools for. So we're gonna buy the same tools here that we bought last time at other places. Some of y'all really had a lot to complain about. So hang around to the end, let's see how cheap we can get them for. Hello. How are y'all doing? Good, how are you? Good. This is pretty big. That's actually pretty big too. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do is go a tool bag. Now, we're not going one a lot cheaper because we want size. This is big enough, feels heavy enough, pretty sturdy Kansas bag. Got outlets on the back side of the clips here. Got a shoulder strap for it. Got some pockets on the inside, so $34.99. First bag. All right, let's see what else we can get. Okay, so instead of going a 35 foot tape measure this time, we're gonna go 25 foot, still a one inch blade, good clear markings on it. Not too bad, it doesn't have a magnetic end, but $4.99, we could get two if we needed to. Okay, this time, not a three piece, but a four piece adjustable wrench, $17.99. It's the only multi I see again for them. Okay, again, not three, but four. $15.99. All right, four in one screwdriver, $1.99. Do you ever look at someone and wonder, what is going on inside their head? Okay, now we're not going the cheapest hammer. We're doing one that will actually hopefully last a while. <clears throat> so we're going $8.99. We could come down as low as $5.99, but this is more of a finished hammer. You're gonna get a lot more out of this, so $8.99. We don't have a four in one, which I think is what we got last time. $3.99, they don't have a four in one, but they have three separate files. Two of them give us what we need. Now these are coarse though. These are actually rasps. <laughs> so we have a five piece file set here, probably a little bit better than the four in one that we got last time, but five piece set, $7.99. We've got a box cutter here. We've also got a snap blade utility knife. Now these are good because they have the different blades on them. I think instead of coming down this much, do this here because it has the change out blade on it. So here we go, a folding lock blade, which is a utility, does good. And you got two different kinds here. Up oh, here we go, $2.99. Okay, so we had a PVC saw and a hacksaw, so I'm gonna get another hacksaw here. $5.99, it's also got a mini hacksaw, so you're kinda getting the bonus points here. And we did a PVC saw. Thought about the serrated machete, but instead we're gonna go just a regular handsaw. So we've got $8.99 and $5.99. $13.99, Hmm. If you just want cheap, probably here, if you want usability here, I'd kind of be afraid to pull that out on a job site. Just saying. But wait a minute. Y'all just want it cheap.
something like that. It's got a hand protector. $2.99. Tubing cutters and pot wrenches. Aluminum, $19.99. Steel, $9.99. Get ready. Okay, they don't have any big 20s or anything like this. This would be similar to a 10 or a 15. It says cutting capacity 1 8 inch to 1 and 1 8. And then mini cutters that cut the same. These are $6.99, these are $5.99. Both. Basin wrench, swivels, spring action, $6.99. Headlamps, all we need. Flashlights, or, or was there a flashlight all? Half of what we walked around the store looking for. We could have got right here. Eleven ninety nine headlamp. Here we go. How are you doing? Now it does show you, Roger. Do not have an Inside Track Club membership. Did you want to no. do the membership because it does get you up to eighty percent off the regular price tags, and the blue price tags change every single month. And no, you get no. Early access to sales and coupons. Not right now. Don't mess up the video if we got eighty percent off. One seventy four oh nine. Now that's a lot cheaper than we spent at the other store. We got everything just about the same. Had to swap out some items back and forth, but if you're wanting to start out in the trades cheap, what a great way to do it. And everything that's Pittsburgh brand has a lifetime guarantee. So let's get out of here.